Have you ever heard me and your mom having sex? Uh, probably. Oh my God. At the old house, you can kind of hear everything. What? My name's John, and uh, Polly is my stepdaughter since she was four years old. So 18 years. My name is Randy, and this is my stepdad. How long have you been her stepdad? 19 years. Uh, how long have been stepdad? Let me see. I better get this right, because my wife is right over there. Um, <laughs> six years. No. <laughs> You've been in my life longer than that. Oh, 10 years? It's been like 12 years. 12 years. I'm bad on dates, by the way. <laughs> yeah. What do you think of me when you first met me, Randy? I was just like, who is this guy? I think at first I was skeptical because it was kind of just me, my mom, my brother and I. And so I was kind of skeptical of like, my mom being like pulled away. Did you fear he was just trying to get in your mom's pants? No, <laughs> not at all. Well, I mean, <laughs> anyway. In what way is your biological dad better than me? None. My dad's always been like absent. He never showed up for gymnastics or my graduation or anything like that. He only talks to me whenever I have a bill to pay or if something happens in the family. She's telling the truth. <laughs> Who's your favorite child? <laughs> Am I? <laughs> wow. I would do anything for any one of my kids. I couldn't put a favorite on it because you're all the same to me as equal. I can't put a favorite, so I've got to drink. I've got to drink. Randy has to be the favorite. What? My youngest daughter is there also, but as far as being more independent, I said, you need some money, Randy? Nope. But now my youngest daughter, do you need this? Yeah, put it in the mail, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Before my mom, how many people have you slept with? I don't remember. Your best guess. My best guess. Mm. Ah, yeah. <laughs> if I had a number, I would tell you the number but that number is not answerable. So you was being a hoe? With a capital H. Right around eight and 15. That's a big, but. I couldn't tell you, because some of those times I was drunk. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever stolen from me? We used to go in the little bottom cabinet and like drink your liquor. Oh, that's <laughs> what was happening. It added. <laughs> your mother Baby. thought that I drank all the liquor. That was us. I'm so glad we did this. <laughs> I am so vindicated today. Have you ever cheated on my mom? Never, never will, never have. I mean, she, you know, she is a six-three black belt. So you wouldn't cheat because you fear she'd beat you up? <laughs> well, I might like that, but no. <laughs> if you see me cheating on your mom with one of her friends, would you tell her? Which friend? Hypothetically. Oh, oh, which, which friend? Would you be caught getting cheated with? And. <laughs> and <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I think you were supposed to bite the bullet on that one. Yeah. You're sleeping on the couch tonight for sure. Have you ever heard me or your mother having sex? <laughs> <laughs> no, I haven't, thank God. My ears are still intact. Uh, probably. Oh my God. At the old house, you can kind of hear everything. What? No. I don't even know if you've ever had sex with her. <laughs> yes, I have. <laughs> Really? Oh yes. my gosh. How often did oh you have God. sex with her? Not very often, probably once every year. Oh my, <laughs> my mom's lesbian, but we didn't find <laughs> we didn't find out until I was 14. And then ever since then, she's been with her partner. You're not with her. No. But you sleep with her once a year. Yes. Still? She asked. <laughs> Do you want? I said okay. <laughs> Oh my God, I do not know the answer to this. Have you ever had a threesome with my mom? No, never. No. Go ahead and ask me, do I want to? <laughs> Go ahead, that's the next question. I feel it, I, feel, I know he's gonna ask that. Do you want to have a threesome? Absolutely not. Who's the person you mentioned before that you eat cut cheating on my mom with? Anne. Yeah. Mm. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, is Anne gonna see this? Oh God, <laughs> Ann, this is just, we're just cutting it up here, Ann. <laughs> just to put it out there. What do I do that annoys you? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Tell me, Randy, what I do, Randy? That. What is that, Randy? That. Randy, come on now. Probably just the volume of the TV. He like blasts it full volume, like what surround. What do you think sound around means? Sound around, whole theater, that's what it means, you know? Blow your wig back. I yeah. can't even hear myself think. You're not supposed to, they're doing it for you. What do I do that annoys you? Honestly, your farts. They don't sound right. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> oh, I enjoyed that one, okay. <laughs> what are my worst parenting traits, Randy? I can't think of anything. I don't have any parenting advice for you or any moments where I felt like you could have been a better parent. He's getting emotional. No, I'm good. <laughs> Has my other parent caused you a lot of trouble? <laughs> He's never been anything. He's been nothing in your life. And when he does ask for stuff, it's normally so he can get away from paying for anything. Yeah. And that's your dad. Do you think that I would be better looking if you were my biological father? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah? Yeah. Go Damn father. right. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be fine as wine, girl. <laughs> Pouring it over big old glass. In what way am I bad for your mom? Well, for one, my mom is lesbian, so I think she prefers women. I think that you guys are a really good match. Like, she's the brains and you're the muscle. Well, at least I'm something, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all right with that. <laughs> Would it have been easier without me in the picture? There's a possibility that we could be richer than rich, but then it would have been more boring. It would always be easier if I didn't have any of the kids in the picture, but that's my ch choice. I did it. So I would still have the same life over again. Am I a good father? Absolutely. Oh, she said it. I think that you're a great father and I don't know any way that I think that you could be a better father. You're like another mom, but you're a guy. You taught me the things that like most mothers teach their daughters, I feel like, because my mom wasn't you know, she wasn't super present, so you filled those shoes when you needed to. So yeah, you're a good mother and father. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Thanks, baby. Thanks. Of course. Mm, my alcohol kicking in. He's getting emotional again. You're a great father to me. I appreciate that. One more for the road. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. How was that? It was good. Yeah. I thought there were going to be more inappropriate <laughs> questions. How raunchy did you want us to get? Oh, not that raunchy. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people don't know this. We have an expansion pack for families. What up, fam? It's got the good questions in there. It's got like, who's the creepy uncle of the family? Who's the creepy uncle in our family? <laughs> He's gone. I was, <laughs> I was thinking of the same person. He's gone. <laughs> <laughs> we were on the same level on that one, buddy. <laughs>